All right, shout out to my master, brother, quarter master, brother, to brother, Karatas, out of the camp, but S O Y W I camp. I want to give all praise and glory to you. How about some of y'all? by some of y'all, that's fucking thumb. Double on the pasta, that's a good mess. Long, well, peace, us, how you taste, so feel like a visual. So, um, to brother, Karatas, out coming into with another quick hitter. Coming into a quick hitter that, uh, eat that Lord hates Esau from the beginning. Esau was doomed from the beginning, and even before the beginning, you know, because, uh, because uh, this video right here says that uh, Hail Satan. Satan is to his Bible at SatanCon, the largest satanic gathering. Now, I'm going to play some clips. I'm going to play a little bit of clip, and you can watch the video for the You can watch the rest of the video for yourself. But uh, this Edomite woman, see, uh, they have a whole Satan congregation. Now, it's not surprised. I'm not surprised by it, you know what I'm saying? Because this place is. Because uh, you going to. There's a scripture uh, It says. Uh, I think it says Job 9, 24, where it says, Earth was given into the hand of the wicked. If we're not so, I would have told you. I think that la that's what that last part said, but I'm not sure. But I got the precept, but uh, I'm going to play a little bit of clip, and uh, I'm going to break it down. Then we're going to get some scriptures. Low willing that this is at a fire. See that book that she has in her uh, in her right hand? That's a Bible. Stand here today in defiance of their siege and destroy their symbols of oppression. Symbols of oppression. <laughs> I'm not even surprised because you got some people that do this behind closed doors. You know, they're not going to be open just like her. You know, they do it behind closed doors. They say they believe in God spiritually, but they're not uh, putting in that work. Or like uh, you, you have Jake's. Uh, you have uh, Jake's uh, that say they believe in God, but uh, the God that they worship is, but the, they worship Satan because they say, worship Caesar Borgia because you got majority of Jake's, two thirds of Israel, uh, Christians, you know. You know what I'm saying? Christianity is just, Christianity is pork. They're abomination. They're pork and they're uh, shellfish. <laughs> That's what they are. You know what I'm saying? But this female, this eating my female, you know, if you ain't eating my, there's nothing you can do. You know what I'm saying? It don't even matter if you know this truth exactly. Admit that you're eating my and admit that so called Caucasian people are Edomites, according to the scriptures. Uh, you know, there's no way that you'll get salvation. Okay? That's that's the way it is, and this eating my woman, uh, she's she's ripping the pages off the Bible, Bible, and uh, a lot of people are cheering, and they're like, yeah, whoo! But then again, you know, like uh, the Lord don't even care, you know, because he's not dealing with these Edomites, he's not dealing with them. And this was supposed to two weeks ago too, you know. Uh, yeah, they have a sh they had a show of Hail Satan. This dude, hold on, let me show you what this dude looked like. Hail. Okay. Director, uh, hell, uh, this dude right here, the uh, uh, this dude right here on the on the on the left side of the video, this E might do who uh, who has no eye, yeah man, and he, <laughs> there you go right here, this woman, this fat E might, this tub of mayo, this, this tub of lard. <laughs> Right here, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, you shouldn't be surprised when you get in this truth because, you know, like, it's not too long. You see? Satan, you know? See that other video where it says, Hail Satan, documentary shows by his uh, satanic temple. See that woman with the, on the right side of the video? It says, Religious Liberty for All on that poster. And you got that statue, too. It's at the Congress, too. So, we know, it, it's not far-fetched, you know? It's a no-brainer, Okay? They they put it in your face, but that's the Lord exposing them. Okay, that's the Lord exposing them. So we're gonna get some scriptures. We're gonna get some scriptures. We're gonna see who Esau is. We're gonna see who Esau is. Genesis twenty five and twenty five, and this is when uh, Isaac and uh, Rebecca had a child. You know, the first one uh, it says right here, and the flesh came out red all over like a hairy garment, and they called his name Esau. So like a uh, red all over. So like uh, now you yeah, have a baby, uh, a baby, uh, uh, red all over garment. Like the people that ain't got no, that has no pigmentation. 
You know, they have no pigmentation, and when they like, and they can't handle the heat, they can't handle the sun, and uh, they and uh, they get a uh, skin cancer too. But uh, that's what. But uh, again, like, and, and another thing you gotta be careful too is uh, you gotta be careful who you spot as you guys. You gotta be careful how, uh, who you see as see the people as you know when you walk by or you see, you know, because they can, there's there's some people that are, there's some people that are outside of Israel. That look like a uh, uh, gentile uh, that look like a uh, uh, heathens, but they could be Israelites to the blood and uh, blood and lineage and to the spirit, you know. Because we were fruitful or multiplied back in the day, you know. And then again, you got some, uh, you got some uh, other Is people that look like Israelites, but they could be Edomites, you know, Tars, okay, Tares. Uh, that's how, I think that's how you say it. Uh, yeah, this. Uh, you had a uh, Jim Carlo Esposito. Uh, he his father is so-called white man, so he's an Edomite. And you had this female, this black female on that show with Anthony, Anthony uh, Davis. Uh. Oh, and you got the uh, Tamara Ta uh, Tamarin sisters uh, from uh, Tamara's sisters. Uh, their father are Edomite. Their father is an Edomite, so they're Edomites. Their mother is so-called black woman, and their father is white. So they're so Edomites. They're so called. They're so called white people. They're Edomites. You are who your father is. And let's see. Uh, the, that's who Esau is. Job, Job nine and twenty four. The earth is given into the hand of the wicked. He covered his face of the judges thereof. If not, where and who he is. You know. So Esau. You know. Uh, Esau. Everything that Esau touches. It, it just turns into uh, it just turns to uh, crap, you know. It's just destroyed, S fought, foul, spoil. Everything that uh, the Lord, everything that Jake Jake touches, uh, Israelites uh, underneath the Habas uh it turns to life, you know. Underneath the Habas Melshaka, everything that the Lord touches, the Heavenly Father touches, it tur it comes to life, you know. And the Son Yahweh and uh, let's go to let's go to Romans nine and thirteen. As it written, Jacob have I love, but Esau have I hated. So the love loves Jacob. You know what I'm saying? And uh, Jacob, uh, the Lord loves Jacob. You know, because it's what the Lord sees. All right, and it was it was already prophesied. It was already predicted by the Heavenly Father, and uh, he already hated Esau. So he hated from the beginning. But the Lord is allowing Esau to be in control, so he, he's allowing everything that's happened that ha that's happened before and that's happening right now, is happening for a reason. So the Lord can establish His judgment on the planet Earth, so all people can fear the Lord. Mainly Israel, beginning with the, the elect, you know, because that's who he's. That's who the Lord is going to send His Son to save when the time comes, when Jacob trouble comes. The elect, one hundred forty-four thousand. Twelve thousand from each twelve from each tribe of the Israel. Twelve thousand twelve thousand Israelites from each tribe. And let's see what happens. Once this place gets destroyed, this is what's gonna happen to Esau. Once oh uh, oh uh, hold on. There's some more there's one more precept. There's one more precept. Hold on. Okay. Obadiah. One and eighteen, and the house of Jacob shall be a fire, and the house of Joseph a flame, and the house of Esau for stubble. So, house of Esau is he's, uh, uh, is America, but then again, like uh, it goes in the seven heads of the beast. Well, well it got, it's mainly America, you know, because it's a powerful country in the world, you know. But right now, all these are, but what's happening right now is these different countries are going against America, you know. They're turning, they they're turning on America. They're going against it, and they're getting ready. And the U.S. dollar, the U.S. dollar currency is going, it, it, it's going down. It's losing value, which it never had value in the beginning. But uh, they're about to bring in that uh, digital dollar, that digital currency. This is the mark, what's it, the C hip, okay, micro C hip, which is the MOTB according to Revelation thirteen and sixteen. Now the Lord is using Esau on the left hand side to execute His judgment, okay. And they shall kindle in them and devour them, and there shall be not any remaining other house of Esau for the Lord. Yahweh has spoken it. 
I'm gonna see what happens once that uh, place gets destroyed. And when the thousand and Esau's gonna be a slave for a thousand years, you know? Hold on. But uh but uh Esau uh he's gonna be a slave for a thousand years, building the kingdom of building our kingdom like we had to, you know, because of our transgression and trespass and sins and transgression and iniquities that we cause against the Heavenly Father. You know, but since we're again redeemed by Yahweh Shah Masyak, the begotten son of the Heavenly Father, the right hand the right hand of the Heavenly Father, you know, going, the Lord and the Son's getting are getting their glory back and we're gonna get our glory back too. Okay? And when the thousand years are expired, Satan shall be loose out of his prison. So like the Lord's gonna uh, line them up and they're gonna and the Lord's gonna burn them up, you know? Burn burn them up, you know, they're gonna burn them to burnt crisp, they're gonna burn them into nothingness. You know, there's not gonna be and after that, there's not going to be one remaining. There's not going to be one Edomite remaining. You know, all of them's going to be extinct. And this is the scary thing because the Lord could do a lot of things that could jack you up. So um, remember to, if you're an Israelite, you know, focus on your house. Okay, focus on your house. Let's see. Because uh, things are happening very quickly. And, uh, we don't have that much time, so with that, hopefully this is edified. I'm gonna give all praise out and glory to you. How about some shout about some more that's working on my own top outside has gonna some well peace of say taste hopefully with Israel. But that's the brother Karat said the camp S O Y W I camp. I want that. Hopefully you edify until I tune in next time. I'm gonna say Shalom.